But but when you are processed for purpose, then at some time there is an appointment. I'm ready to preach. At some time there is an appointment with your name on it. And, 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 and when it is your time, and when it is your season, there is not one thing that the enemy can do to hold you back. So that's why you ain't got to get upset and depressed and mad and, and, and all frustrated when people don't want to be bothered with you. That's why you ain't got to be worried and concerned about when they tell lies on you. No lie can live forever. All you got to do is keep on doing what you do. Let God process you. Let him cleanse you. Let him sanctify you. And when your time comes, no devil in hell can keep you from the place that God has for you. Come on and clap those hands and say amen. amen. So they had to let Jephthah, come on Will, so they had to let Jephthah, they had to let him back into, and so so when he came back, when, when Jephthah came back, when they went and got him out of the land of Tom, let's talk about the land of Tom for a minute. So they went and got him out of the land of good. But Gilead, was not a place of good. Gilead was a place of, the, the, the Bible dictionary says that it's a place, of, it's a rugged place with a lot of peaks and valleys and jagged edges and mountains. So, 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 so God, his purpose was not to stay in the land of good. His purpose, he was a warrior. And so some of you don't understand why well, all your life, you, all my life I had to fight. <laughs> you don't, and you don't you don't understand you don't understand why all your life you had to fight it is because your purpose is to be a warrior in the kingdom of God your purpose is to tear down strongholds your purpose is to go in to the enemy's camp and take back everything that he stole from you your purpose is to speak truth to power that's why you don't get along with folks because God don't want you to be so concerned about your friends that you can't say what he said so sometimes you gotta go against the brain sometimes you gotta go against what's popular sometimes you gotta go against the status quo because that is what thus saith the Lord yes, 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 yes. Woo. so he didn't want your family to accept you he wanted them to turn on you. He wanted them to reject you. He wanted, okay. There's a purpose in the divorce. There's a purpose in your broken heart. There's a purpose in the people who rejected you. There's a purpose in losing friends. There is a purpose in losing the job. There is a purpose in the car getting repossessed. There's a purpose in getting evicted out the house. There is a purpose. Everything you have gone through in your life has set you up for such a time as this. So when you've had a broken heart, when people message you on Facebook and say, I just don't understand why I'm going through this, I can tell them because I've been there and I've done that. Okay, you can't, never been, can't tell one know how to get there. So you can't lead somebody to a place you've never been. You can't tell nobody they can make it when you ain't never had to make it do nothing. Yeah. You can't tell nobody that even with a felony, you, God can still bless you yeah. if you ain't never got one. Come on, testify, Mr. Yeah. Watson. Yeah. You can't tell nobody that. Yeah. See, we want testimonies without tests. We want triumphs without trials. Yeah. But if you're going to walk into your purpose, you must be processed yes. for the purpose yeah. so that you can receive the promise. Yes. 